Sources tell News Center 5 that a deal to end the market basket battle is in its final stages. News Center 5's Jorge Quiroga is outside a store in Burlington tonight with what's happening behind the scenes. Jorge? Well, Ed, this fight reports that a buyout is close at hand. Behind the scenes, here on the front lines, employees and customers continue holding out to quote the immortal Yogi Barra. It ain't over till it's over. Once again today, workers and customers remained unwavering outside company headquarters. Like John Lane, out here just about every day for the past six weeks. They did not expect the, uh, the uh, workers to go out and the customers to go out. It's solidarity. Many here waiting with bated breath and dwindling bank accounts. Rosie Hagopian has worked for the company for 41 years. Morale is good. Morale is very good. No problem with morale. Anticipating the standoff to end. You got to stick your neck out. Sources telling News Center 5 the two sides are very close. The deal on track and that members of the Market Basket Board have coordinated their schedules to allow for quick action if shareholders can ink the deal. The suspense nerve wracking. We get all excited. We're ready to come back. You know, the guys are all, we're all going to shave, put on our white shirts and ties. The girls are all ready to get dressed. And, and then we don't hear anything, you know. But that's okay. We're going to get there. Hopefully sooner than later, ending a protracted mess. I think there'll be a, a little bit of a celebration for a short time, and the next day it's going to be all business. And tonight we're told everything is in a holding pattern. Reportedly, the deal by former CEO Arthur T. DeMoulis is worth $1.5 billion, with $500 million coming from a private equity firm. Live in Burlington, Jorge Quiroga, WCBB, New Center 5.